I tried creatine for the last 30 days. Hey guys, my name is Nicholas Byrne and I've been lifting for the past four years, but I've never tried creatine. But I have an upcoming powerlifting meet, so it's a perfect time to see because I've heard that creatine can give 8 to 12% strength increase, which is actually insane. So I need to see if this actually would work because then I would like conquer my powerlifting meet, you feel me? So I took on this challenge. But before we talk about what happened in the 30 day challenge, let's talk about what creatine is. So in simple terms, creatine is basically a backup battery. When your body performs a really hard task, it uses the molecule ATP for energy, and ATP then converts to ADP, which has less energy. Creatine basically helps change that ADP back to ATP, giving your body more energy to perform hard intensity workouts. So what does this mean? Creatine helps your body produce more energy, especially in high intense workouts like weightlifting or sprinting. This process allows your muscles to work harder for a longer period of time. This can help build strength, muscle, and endurance. And the main benefit of this is helping strength and muscle. Now that we got the definition out of the way, I'm gonna be explaining what I'm gonna be doing in the next 30 days. So for the first two weeks, I'm gonna be doing a loading phase with creatine monohydrate, which I'm basically gonna be taking 10 grams a day instead of five to get my body fully saturated. And then for the rest of the time, I am gonna be using five grams. I've also took a break from squatting and deadlifting for about a year and a half, but I'm gonna get back into it because my back finally feels good enough to go in. And I think squatting and deadlifting is such a great leg workout and I'm just missing out. So that's gonna happen. Now that we got that out of the way, let the journey begin. So this is the creatine I'm going to be using. It's um, creatine from the Raw Nutrition. You can actually use my code Nicholas Burnt if you want a discount. So uh, let's, let's, let's try it. Okay, so we got 10 grams of creatine and some pre-workout here. We're weighing it at 152.2, so now I'm gonna go to the gym and hit some PRs. Definitely not the best form. Oh, we're gonna take it. <laughs> we're just gonna take it. Ah, ah. Hey guys, so it's week one of trying creatine and the results are pretty good. Like I've gained probably like three pounds just off of like loading this week and recovery time has been so fast. Like for some reason, I feel like I don't get sore anymore. Like I'll push out a workout Okay, maybe I over exaggerated, but like, recovery time is so much faster. I haven't seen much changes with like, my strength, but that's because it's only been one week. I'm excited to see if I can hit 315 bench on the end of the 30 days. Hopefully I can, and maybe I'll be squatting like, 5,000 pounds. Yes, I got that. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in one other week. I'll see you guys week two. Hey guys, so we're two weeks using creatine and my weight has gone up so much. Like, I think in this challenge I was like 152 or whatever, and now I'm 157. Kind of crazy. I might have to cut back some weight, but I don't think it's all creatine. I think it's also just because I've been eating a little more, I think. But, um, yeah, I haven't really noticed too much with the strength yet, but again, the recovery time is a lot faster. So, yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing like the strength progression on week four though. I want to see if like, yeah, 
I want to see how much weight it's gone up. Alright, I'll see you guys week three. Hey guys, it's week three of using creatine and something pretty crazy happened. So I was at the gym and I usually do my lap pull downs with like 125, but today I just put on, like I accidentally put 145 and I was like, holy shit, this is so easy. I did it pretty easy. So I went to 165 and I did a full working set with that. And, and like before my max working set was like 125 for like eight and I did 165 for eight. So that's a pretty big increase. That's like 40 pounds on just lap pull downs. All the, most of the exercises are getting a little easier. I do feel strength increase. I'm not, not, not everything went up like the lap pull downs, but I am definitely feeling a little stronger. So that is cool. Only one more week till week four. I think I'm getting to the point where I'm fully saturated. So I guess we'll see how the results play out. Hey guys, so it's officially day 30 of using creatine and we are gonna see what the results are. We're gonna go look at my body, see if anything changed, and then we'll go to the gym and try our one rep PRs. I'm excited, I'm excited. Uh, I'm not sure if I cut anything on bench, but I'm pretty sure that my squat and deadlift have definitely gone up. So let's go take a look at the body, see where we're at. I'll put my stats over here and yeah. I'm not sure if this is the same angle, but, uh, but I'll just pray it is. All right. Okay guys, so I didn't really see much of a change in my body, but if you're interested, here are the stats. Okay, I'm going to measure my weight now. Okay guys, so deadlifts, feeling real heavy today. It's okay though, we got it. If I can figure out how to put these on. Okay, I can't believe we got that. Okay guys, so the gym is closed. I have to, I asked them for five minutes. So I have five minutes to finish up this. To be honest, I'm not, I'm not rested enough, but it's okay. We'll just, we'll just cram it out. This is 2.45. So in conclusion, does creatine work? In my opinion, yes. So in this challenge, I was on vacation for around nine days. So I didn't have that much time to actually work with. And in the first week, I was feeling kind of sick. So to actually achieve these results under these circumstances was really impressive. My bench went from 295 to 305. My squat went from 255 to 
295. My deadlift went from 345 to 365. And for reference, I hit bench six times in the last 30 days, squat four times, deadlift two times. Like I said, my time was limited because I was on vacation and in the hotel gyms didn't have a bench, squat, or deadlift rack. But these results were really amazing. But for my squat and deadlift, I don't think you should expect these results for like the amount of training I did because it's kind of like newbie gains coming back to me because I haven't worked them out for like a year and a half. So that was cool. I was definitely stressing how much I didn't feel sore, but I think that was just the loading phase because now that like I'm fully saturated, I am getting sore again, definitely do feel sore, but I do feel like I got stronger. So I 100% recommend trying creatine. And if you want to use the one I used and help support the channel, you can use the one from Raw Nutrition in the link below. Also, you can use my code NicholasBurnt for 10% off. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye bye.